Turns out I do have an electric type. I should've just pressed down, there we go. Wait, no, it's held on. It's too fast to press down! Uh, I think it's like, third floor... Yeah... There we go. Darwin is evolving! But now a Jolteon. Hooray. Now for them to never learn any electric moves. No, I did not leave any TMs on me. Alright, let's go back to Sevar. Actually... Let's make a bad choice instead. Do I have cut? No. Uh, let's throw you in. Recognize us having cut. Some of these names I just have to be like, what the fuck did I do? Like, seriously. I was trying to remember why named Snorlax, but there he is, Lard Lad. Uh, I think Wacko was, uh. Yeah, Duck. And they already know Cut. Let's go. I go back through this route because can't fly to that Pokemon Center yet. Not until like Fire Red Leaf Green. Of course, I don't know about Gen 2, I've never played a Gen 2 game. Hey, sir, how's it going? Well, let's put ground type in front. Guess... Oh, I probably already bowed you when I caught two. Oh, you know, I should've gone here instead of the department store for a thunderstone. Oh well. Too late now. It's not like I can use Earthquake against the Thunderburb. Okay, I probably shouldn't be using Earthquake on every single Magnemite. This 
This uh, user is quite gone, though. Alright, TM-33, and an eyeball torp. And that's why I wanted to kill him quickly. Nope, item. Um, reflect garbage. Maybe if it lasted for more than three turns, I might consider using it. But as it stands, it's garbage. One damage, wow. So many Voltorbs. Sonic Boom is eh, is the second scariest thing they can do. And Magnum might probably unlearned it by now. Oh wait, I need to be saving Rock Throw. Get out of here, Grimer. Oh shoot, yeah, I should Earthquake Grimer because they can do poison. I don't want to be poisoned. TM25, what's that? I think it might be Thunder, yep. Uh, who can learn it? Bless you and Patra, then... Probably Darwin. Thankfully I'm faster than Grimer, so I can actually run from them if need be. Yay, Andy's is leveling up. Let's use a potion before they end up like... Ignore Cell. I only have eight hyper potions? Are you serious? Definitely need to stock up on those then. Get out of here, Voltorb. Dungeon's just gonna be obnoxious, huh? Let's see, there's an item up here, rare candy. I feel like I should have gone here for a level grinding. Oh well. I am out of earthquakes now. 
course Magneton still knows Sonic Boom. No, let's just run for Brimers now. Another Voltorb. I don't know if it's Electra this time. And just immediately. Thank God I've got a physical take who's resistant. And there's Thunderburb. Uh, I wish I didn't need to use a second potion, but there we go. Really? I just used the potion, god damn it. I hate you so much. I was expecting a crit there. Just exert my dominance. Or not. Holy shit, Andy's fucking hit! Honestly, I don't think even a crit could kill Andy's right now. They're low health, just strength. There we go. Dominance exerted. Heal everyone. And then let's go ahead and swap out the whack over Darwin. Okay, now I've got to, like train Darwin. That's gonna be the hard part. Okay, who's gonna be good against next gem? Patron, Andes. Honestly, I'm not particularly weak to fire. Check out this route. Sid Bar in the West has a lab for Pokemon. Yeah, unfortunately I'm not gonna know any electric type moves yet, so just gotta keep swapping out. Why did I even organize by usefulness the next gym if I'm not gonna make use of it? There we go. Wait! Boyfriend gave me big pearls. Why are there so many beauties in the ocean? No, I don't trust Darwin to fight this right now. Great. I'll be fine. See. I can't wait for EXP share. Again? Is 
seriously, Rock Through has more accuracy than Super Sock. You see how often I hit with that. <sighs> Holy fuck. Touch my pearls. I wrote my bird Pokemon here. Oh, bird Pokemon, eh? How about some rocks? Ah uh, yes, can mirror remove the slow thing that hasn't attacked yet. Just use strength. Still need more EXP for Darwin. I don't know how quickly I can get that EXP to rise when... And they're only level 30. Seriously, has Darwin even leveled up once? Okay, I think they've leveled up exactly once. They would probably start at 25. Oh no! Okay, this you could kill easily. Hey, look, another trainer! She got my buff physique! Finally, swimmers exist. You know, in the swimming route. Staryu isn't psychic type yet. Wimpy. Are you on vacation too? Ah, it's a junior trainer, of course. How could I have not expected that? Like honestly, that was just on me. Yay, Darwin finally leveled up. Did everything I ever wanted? No, I want more. I could've just used Swift on Horsey, but we're also at the end of the route. Yep, this is exactly why I... I was doing... Why I do switch bow style instead of set. Cause there's no EXP share! No mercy at all! Okay, back to Sevar. Go ahead and restore the psychics. And then let's go ahead and clear out some northern trainers, because I managed to dodge all of them. Great, how much darn gonna hurt themselves? Not at all, okay. Yeah, feel the sun, the wind. Okay, Patron. Keep doing murder. Let's 
set the cools next. Honestly, there are special tanks, so I could probably just kill them with Swift. Oh yeah, I guess Cedra also learns Poison Sting. Also, Darwin leveled up again, yay! I caught all my Pokemon at sea. Like, do I even bother trying to do unique voices for these swimmers anymore? Also, I'm definitely fighting a uh, Starmie, whom I have nothing against. Uh. I mean, they're probably not going to learn Psychic since they don't learn it naturally. So let's go for a Confuse Ray and Body Slam. As they're just spamming Harden. Thank you for the crit. There we go. Diver down! Hey, don't scare away the fish! You only know quick attack, you're not winning. Oops, Swift did not do as much damage as I expected. It's fine. Swap out Darwin to get rid of Confusion, and also give Darwin the XP, the most important part. They finally missed! I don't believe it. Sorry, I didn't mean it! Keep me company till I get a hit! Alright, let's go Sea King. Fight Patron instead. So like, who built this like, little square of dock just out here in the middle of the ocean? Could Golding fuck me up? Maybe. They might know Water Pulse. Apparently they know Horn Attack. Which honestly makes sense since they have a horn. That burned some Tom! There we go. Here's some more trainers. See, Clint is my body and soul! Oh, I need to go down, not up. Just keep pushing Patron towards level 50, I guess. What do I expect Tentacruel will do? Poison Sting? Oh man, I get strict. Goodbye. Hey ya! What's wrong with me swimming? Um. Hi there, Cube. All how's it going?
Alright, well, I guess I'll just kill your tech, all like the rest. God, Darwin has so little HP. So is Patron, apparently. Actually, no, I was looking at the wrong HP number for Patron. Yeah, no, it's just Darwin who's really far behind right now. Of course, they're also, like, many levels lower, but hey. It's like 20 levels under, I guess. Close enough. Oh, goody. Time waster. Well, double kick is something, I guess. Uh, it was tail whip. It's the least useful move there. Cheap shot. You. Fight me. Oh no, I regret already. Shoot, shouldn't have gotten rid of, of Tail Whip, huh? Should have just like kept Tail Whip just do like Tail Whip double. Just like use a tail whip on each of these magic carps to try and make this go faster. Oh God, it just only started lagging a bit. I don't know what that was about. It's weird how like all the volume lowers when you turn on speed up. Seriously, this poor guy with all of his high-level unevolved magic harps. Another crit, wow. Seriously, what is the crit rate in this game? You know, it's just the waste of time battle that's in pretty much every game. Darn Magikarp! 